So I've been feeling very cocoony lately is the way I've been describing it. And what it feels like is like I'm swimming in a soup of a lot of percolating ideas or percolating energy, but I don't really have the energy to press on the pedal, press on the gas to make anything happen yet. And I've also been feeling a little bit more tired recently. And of course, you know, it's getting darker sooner. So that's probably a little bit of it, getting used to that. But I asked my Instagram followers on Monday a couple of days ago how they were feeling and I got a lot of responses back on feeling tired. So I went in to check with the Arcturians to see what kind of insight they have on why we might be feeling tired at this time. So if you've been feeling tired, stay tuned because they did offer a distinction between two reasons why you might be feeling tired at this time. Welcome back to my channel, The Unravel Collective. My name is Yvonne and I love to unravel the human condition to reveal the multidimensional self. I offer channeled guidance and I mostly work with the Ninth Dimension Arcturian Council. So let's see what they had to say about feeling tired. Everything I'm about to share with you is directly channeled by the Arcturians. We're seeing that there is an enormous amount of energy moving on the planet at this time. And this is causing many to feel tired. And feeling tired is something one should not feel bad about. Feeling tired is a natural cycle of the body integrating certain thoughts, healings, energy systems that are being transformed and shifted. Feeling tired is a natural response to allow for this integration or healing to occur. Feeling tired is also a response to maybe just having a large emergence of energy or taking action or doing something in regards to creativity or to having an idea in which you just brought forth or birthed, so to speak. And so the natural tendency after a birth is to feel tired, to feel that with that enormous effort that just took place, it's time for rest. So even if you personally have not felt that you have necessarily birthed anything, there is birthing taking place on the planet as a collective and as Mother Gaia shifts her energy. And there are many cycles taking place at this time in which we are immersing ourselves in the energy of birth and then integrating the energy into our tissues, into our cellular makeup, into the transformation of becoming a new type of being on the planet, a new type of human on the planet. And this requires rest after these moments of birth. So you could equate this to a mother giving birth and needing rest afterward. There's also the period of great connection to that which has been birthed. So when we look at the parallel of a mother giving birth, there's a deep, deep desire for rest and a deep desire for connection and a nurturing response that occurs. This is also taking place inside you as Mother Gaia shifts and as the energy shifts into these great expansive points and moments of new energies on the planet. And as we said, the body is integrating these energies. One is required to rest and one is feeling the desire for connection, deeper connection to oneself, to source, to our friends and family, to our community. Connection to what we are engaging with. Is this worth my time? So we're seeing the effects of this shift take place in the result of being more discerning of what we allow ourselves to engage with. And you're beginning to feel the shifts and the unfulfillment of engaging with things that do not feel worth your time any longer. So not only does this drain you and has you feel tired and not in the nurturing like way, but in a draining type of tired in which your energy is sucked out of you in a way that doesn't feel nurturing, but rather in a way that feels like your energy is being sucked away from you your creativity is being numbed, your responsiveness is numbed, your motivation is numbed. So this is a different type of tired that's occurring for some of you. And it's because you are feeling the energy shifts occurring within your body that are asking for 
and that are desiring for and are craving for deeper connection, that are offering you deeper connection. So here we are in a space where we are at a new level of discernment, even around our tiredness. So that was everything they shared with us today um, around being tired. And I just think that's a really interesting take on the two reasons that we're feeling. Well, actually, there were three reasons um, on why we may be feeling tired. One, uh, the planet is shifting and we are feeling the effects of Mother Gaia shifting, which then makes us tired because we are certainly connected to Mother Gaia. Oh, my God. <laughs> My kitten just climbed up my leg. Say hi. Say hi. And then the second reason of why we may be feeling tired is because we just went through an emergence cycle, an emergence of giving birth to something, perhaps some great project, some great new idea. And the natural cycle of that is to then need some rest. And the third reason being that we need to have more discernment about what we're engaging with because as we're shifting with Mother Gaia and shifting into new ways of being and this new human that they were speaking of, we are then beginning to crave deeper connection and what we're engaging with may not be providing that deeper connection or that fulfillment or that nurturing that we are now desiring, that we're craving. There are things now that just don't work with our energy that don't match our energy that don't fulfill us in the way they used to and so being really mindful of going ahead and allowing some of those things to drop away maybe it's a tv show maybe it's instagram you know maybe it's certain people you follow maybe it's certain activities that you're no longer interested in like drinking or going out every night who knows i don't know what it is but we are beginning to feel the effects of that unfulfillment and if we continue to engage with it it's going to drain us and make us tired now she's playing with the tripod okay anyway as i was saying it's going to drain us and make us tired in a different way than in the way we're allowing ourselves to feel nurtured and rested after effort or simply because we need to integrate the shifts and transformation occurring. So wonderful distinctions, I thought. Awesome insight. And I hope that it was helpful for you today. And I hope that you're giving yourself uh, lots of rest and self-care and that you are also uh, being in observation of those things that you need to maybe let go of now. Have a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Bye.